Hey everybody, uh, Amy Willie here, Interim Executive Director at Brantwood Camp. And last week we did a tour of a boys camp cabin so folks could see uh, what that looks like. And today I thought that we would do the same thing, but I'm down here at the girls camp. So hanging out here at the girls camp. So I'm outside of a cabin called Minnewaska. We'll take a little quick look at the outside and then we'll go inside. But before we do that, I just wanna show you guys behind me get my head out of the way here is a nice view of our awesome beaver pond that we have here at the girls camp so uh, a lot of cool stuff happening at the beaver pond and folks who are in Minnewaska and some of the junior side cabins uh, have a nice view of that pond okay so let's go take a look around and we'll see what a girls camp cabin is all about so the first thing you might notice about the girls camp cabins is they have a really nice porch area um, so that's a great place to hang out during rest hour and maybe some other times as well. All right, so let's head inside. So here at the girls camp, each cabin has five built in bunk beds. So that's 10 beds for campers that are bunk beds. That's what they look like. And in addition, each cabin also has a cot for a camper. So there are a total of 11 campers that can stay in a cabin here at the girls camp. Now, as far as storage goes, uh, we've got spaces under the bunks for shoes, small bags, and things like that. And then I just set a couple up here so you could get a quick look and see what this might look like. But um, each camper is assigned a bin and you'll unpack your clothes and um, and put them right in the bin there and that's one of the places you can store stuff in addition to keeping things in small bags and having those uh, under your bunks. Okay, so each cabin again has room for 11 campers and then there are two staff members who will stay right in here. Uh, in this cabin with the campers. They have a little bit of a separated area, but that's just right here. So this is the staff area at the girls camp. So there are two side-by-side -side beds here for the two staff and the place that staff can store their things. Let me just pull one of these out is um, these nice big uh, drawers in here that roll in and out from under the bed. So uh, that's where staff would keep their stuff. Okay guys, so we're back outside where I'm standing on the porch and the door to get in the cabin is right behind me. Uh, but you might be wondering, well, what do I do with my larger suitcases or duffel bags or things like that? And each cabin actually has sort of a uh, built-in closet storage area. Um, and that's where we would keep larger items that we don't need access to all the time. So larger duffel bags, larger suitcases, um, things that are empty because we've unpacked them and our stuff is in the cabin so they would go right there okay and then one additional thing just to point out is each cabin also has um, some little pegs on the outside and that's where we might hang uh, raincoats jackets um, stuff like that so that's where all of that goes hey guys thanks so much for joining me for this super quick tour on uh, what a cabin at the girls campus looks like remember there are six cabins that look exactly like this one uh, there are a maximum of 11 campers per cabin and always two staff members who are assigned to each cabin group who live right in here with the campers. And that's all we had to show you today. So thanks for joining and we look forward to catching you again soon on another video.